and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to the vlog, and welcome to this snowy Saturday edition of Skip Dasher. Alright guys, we got a ton of snow last night. Um, probably about, well not a ton, but uh, for April, a ton. So we got uh, probably about six to eight inches of snow in my area and uh, it's interesting for sure. Yesterday was beautiful while well, it was okay and the crappy weather rolled in and and uh, now we got lots of snow. So anyways guys, it is Saturday. I uh, picked up a uh, an afternoon shift right now with everything that's going on. You can basically pick and choose whatever shifts you want. Um, so I'm working a skip the dishes shift from 11 till three uh, or 11 to two or something like that. And uh, signed into Door to DoorDash as well too and got the first order. Uh, it's 11.30 or 11.28. I uh, got the first order, DoorDash won. So good job, DoorDash. It says first, first order is at the Chopped Leaf and Mahogany. So I have a fairly quick drive to there. And uh, then it's going to, I think, Prestwick. So it's a nice quick order. Um, anyways, let's go to the Chopped Leaf and pick this up and start this lunch run. Holy crap, you guys, that was absolutely frustrating beyond measure. So I went to the, uh, went inside the chopped leaf in Mahogany, right there. And uh, they had not even started the order yet. So then a skip the dishes driver comes in and uh, they do his order first. That takes about 10 minutes and then they start on my order. Takes a lot of patience to not get super frustrated at those people in there. Anyways, order has been picked up. I did text the customer, but they never got back to me, so I just let them know what was going on. Waste of time. All right, so this customer is six minutes away, 3.9 kilometers. Let's go. All right, guys, that order's done. Four dollars for base pay, four dollars for tip. And I did. Uh, restart my skip shift or unpause my skip shift waiting for skips and dashes all right guys just got my first skip order finally i uh, just been parked here on 130th avenue um it's 1208 right now just for reference and this next order is at jerusalem shawarma um, on 130th here and when i pick it up it's going to new brighton uh, the order is eight dollars and 42 cents and it's going 3.6 kilometers let's go um Acceptance rating is still at 90%. All right, guys, so that order is picked up. We are ready to drive. And this lady is in New Brighton. And she's 10 minutes, 2.6 kilometers away. Let's go. Morning. Morning, how are you? Good. All right, guys. Fellow skip driver. Okay, so that order's done. We actually got uh, an order from uh, Little Caesars, which is really, really close, and it's a nice order. Uh, it's $7.80, and it's like three kilometers or something like that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually pause my skip shift before I check this order off. Okay, so that order's done. That was $8.42 from Jerusalem Shawarma. So $4 for transit, $4.42 for tip. And then now we are headed to Little Caesars. And that is five minutes, 2.4 kilometers away. Let's go. All right, guys, order's been picked up. Had a better experience in there than the last time. A little bit better experience, Not let's not get too carried away now. Okay, so this customer is 
five minutes, 1.5 kilometers away. So what I'm gonna do, as soon as I start driving, I'm going to unpause my skip uh, shift and uh, we'll see if we can get another skip order right away. Okay guys, that was really weird. Um, so the first DoorDash order I did, I just dropped it off and did the normal procedure. This one, it had a big thing about contactless delivery and I had to um, either call the customer or leave it. And uh, when I did leave it, I had to take a picture of it, write a description, which was really weird. Um, never had to do that before, so that's new. Uh, $4 for base pay, three eighty dollars for tip. Okay, so we are on our way to, uh, sorry, as I was walking up to their house, I got a, a skip order. So it's at Papa John's on McIver Boulevard. Uh, not very far away. Didn't even look at where it's going to. So it's going to Copperfield, uh, which is gonna be very, very close. And uh, the total order was $6.80, but it was bumped up to seven. So anyways, guys, on my way to Papa John's and uh, just for reference, that's uh, seven minutes, um, sorry, it never picks the right location. That's about five minutes, probably about three kilometers away. Let's go. Okay guys, uh, order's been picked up. Uh, I was ready to go in there, it was super quick, so that's awesome. Uh, this is in Copperfield, so it's five minutes, 2.5 kilometers away. Let's go. Oh. All right guys, order's done. Okay, that was quick. It's 12.52 right now. Oh, I missed a DoorDash opportunity because I didn't bring my phone in with me, so. Good lesson, carry your phone with you when you're double dashing. Okay, so that was Papa John's. So that was $7 total, $4 for transit, 37 cents for top up, 2.63 for tip. So, um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start making my way home. It's 12.52. Uh, I'm hoping the lunch rush continues for about another hour, but uh, we'll see. If I do make it home, I'm gonna end my shift. But uh, if I do get another order, I'll let you guys know. All right, guys, got an order at Tim Hortons here in Copperfield. Uh, just left the customer's house, and I'm very, very close to the Tim Hortons. Uh, this is for, through Skip the Dishes. So the order is $7.75, total distance is 5.9 kilometers. So when I do pick this up, it's going to Douglas Dale. Um, so not too far. Anyways, Tim Hortons is just up the road. Let's go. All right, guys, order was uh, just a couple minute wait in there. It allowed me to get a bathroom break in which is hard to find these days. Okay, so we are ready to drive. This customer is in Douglasdale. Uh, sorry, McKenzie, um, McKenzie Lake. And uh, 10 minutes, 5.4 kilometers, let's go. All right, guys, the order's done. Okay, so that Tim Hortons order, $7.75, $5.75 for transit, $2 for tip. So it's one eleven. Um, again, I'm gonna make my way home and we'll see what happens on the way. All right, guys, home. I uh, didn't get another order on the way home, so gonna end this shift. So right now it is 1.23. I'm going to end my DoorDash. Okay, so this one, uh, two deliveries, $15.80. And skip the dishes. We did three orders, uh, $23.17. Total between all of that is, come on. $38.97. Wow, for about two hours worth of work. 
Uh, so we drove 30.5 kilometers. So that's not too bad. Um, it definitely wasn't as busy as I thought it would be this lunch rush, but it was snowing last night, snowing this morning, and then now the sun has come out and it's melting everything. So people aren't scared to uh, to go outside. So um, that's it, guys. Quick little lunch shift on the Saturday. Um, what else? There's a couple of things I was going to tell you. Oh, this past week has been brutally slow. Um, I've basically canceled every single shift I had this past week. It wasn't busy for me at all. Um, I, my acceptance rating with that last Tim Hortons order is back up to 100%. So that's a positive. Um, so that's it, guys. If this is your first time here and you've watched this far, you might as well hit that subscribe button down below. Uh, when you do hit that subscribe button, don't forget to hit the bell so you get notified when I release new videos and uh, also give the video a thumbs up. If you guys are on Facebook, I do have a Facebook group called The Lighter Side. Uh, great way to chat and stay connected, uh, not on, on YouTube. So anyways, guys, that's it. Thanks for tuning in to this, uh, this Saturday lunch shift and uh, hope you, hopefully you are staying safe and um, everything's going well for you and your family. Thanks for tuning in. Have a great day, great evening, wherever, whenever you're watching this and we'll see you next time.